Hi boys and girls, Bruce here with another guitar uh, creativity tutorial today. Not so much playing today, what I'm going to talk about today is the notion of authenticity and, and really writing what comes from within. I think we spend a lot of time, and I'm completely guilty of this, of, of trying to, to play everything under the sun, to learn everything under the sun, be it techniques for recording, be it um, a thousand different guitar styles, country, you know, I'm not really a country person. I love some of the country playing, don't get me wrong, I absolutely love it, I'm fascinated by it, and I would love to be able to play some of that. But it's not really my core. It's, uh, I try and incorporate it when I can, but it's not my core values. Along with another style, you know, I've, I've studied jazz, but jazz, I don't, I, I appreciate all the theory, I love the theory, and I wish I could understand it more, but, I'm not an authentic jazz player, and I think that sometimes comes across. And this was a lesson that Steve Vai once uh, told when I did a course, a Berkeley course with Steve Vai, um, about you know being authentic. So just think about that, what that means to you. So that means when you pick up the guitar or start writing something on the keyboard or whatever kind of creative thing you're doing, think about just being you, what comes out from you, let yourself play. And another top tip that Steve gave was, try and write songs sometimes as if you know that no one was going to listen to them. Yeah, because then you haven't got to worry about anything. You actually, yeah, if you know no one's going to hear it, what would you do? I find that a really, really fascinating concept because it gets away a lot of the stress. You're not thinking about Oh, it needs to do this and I need to be able to do this. It's something that just comes from totally within you and you'll be surprised at what comes out and you'll also be surprised I think as well as I have been. That when you do something which is authentic people tend to latch on to it more because it is original and it is unique rather than trying to mirror other things that are out there. I think learning a thousand licks and learning other people's songs are fundamental to developing an instrument because they give you indicators of things you like, they give you indicators of ways of improving your technique and things you need to look at and, and also insight into to sounds that you like perhaps in a chord progression. But I think taking your own material and just playing something as if no one was listening then that's your authenticity. And it's something worth exploring. I'm just putting that out there. You don't have to follow this advice. I most probably, probably won't. But it's just a thought out there. Think about, are you being authentic? And I think, ultimately, people tend to latch on more to people who are being totally open and authentic uh, and original and creative. Enjoy. <laughs>